Unseen the Lives of Looking is a contemporary art show here in the Queen's House at Greenwich. Dryden Goodwin is the fourth artist in the latest programme at Greenwich. Contemporary art allows us a particularly uh, vibrant way to think differently about our collections and our site. Dryden has created his first feature-length film, specially commissioned by us for this exhibition, and he mixes very, very detailed um, observation of uh, people's faces, both strangers and uh, interviewees, and very panoramic images of London, of the sites that he's working with. The film and exhibition follow three modern lookers, the eye surgeon Professor Sepengti Kaur, the planetary explorer Professor Sanjeev Gupta, and the human rights lawyer Rosa Curling. Looking has always been relevant to our site and the way that Dryden brings the present day and the complexities of present day technology and observation to that make it a particularly rich story for us. So we have three individuals from the history of Greenwich in the exhibition. First we have John Flamsteed, the Astronomer Royal, who was the first Astronomer Royal at the observatory from the 1670s. And he observed the sky using the best technologies of the period in order to create accurate star charts that could be used for navigation. Willem van der Velde, the Elder, was an artist who worked here in the Queen's House in the late 17th century. He and his son came over to England at the invitation of Charles II in the 1670s and worked in a studio at the back of the Queen's House. Edward Walter Maunder was an astronomy assistant at the observatory in the 1890s and early um, 20th century. He used our great equatorial telescope, still functioning today, to observe sunspots, but he also particularly worked with the headmaster and boys at the Royal Hospital School, the buildings of which are now the National Maritime Museum, to make observations of Mars. One of our more recent acquisitions in the exhibition is a globe of Mars produced in 1909. It's based on the maps of an American astronomer called Percival Lowell, and it's covered in straight lines representing canals on the surface of Mars. This is the theory that Edward Walter Maunder was attempting to disprove in his work in Greenwich, and particularly that he succeeded in showing was merely an artefact of vision in his experiments with the help of the boys at the Royal Hospital School. One of my favourite objects in the exhibition is a drawing by van der Velde the Elder. It's of the Battle of Schoenveld in 1673, which was the first battle that he observed from the English side after moving from Holland, and it's a really beautiful, sketchy, very quick, full of energy drawing of the battle. We know that van der Velde took rolls of paper out with him to observe battles in, at first hand and then would bring these back and, and turn them into paintings. And the style of his drawing relates beautifully to Dryden's style in his contemporary drawings, so there's a conversation across the centuries.